Okay, we are uh, live on the Quazette, uh, Jonathan Mildenhall, talking about TAN. What, what, is you, what have you seen that's new and different this year and interesting? Well, I think the most significant thing about CAM this year is the uh, Innovations Award um, because that is attracting uh, a very, very different type of creator. It's uh, 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 attracting people who grew up in product design, in technology, not just necessarily marketing and advertising. And uh, I think that the jurors have been particularly focused in establishing this uh, award as a pure innovation um, uh, category. And so you'll see in the awards this evening the advertisers kind of fared less well. And it, was, it was almost technologically more interesting than a direct application to a brand. Absolutely, absolutely. And I think that that's been quite strategic and I think that we're going to see a, a proliferation of um, really innovative product and software design companies also being attracted to CAN as a result of this award. What do you see the role of creativity and technology and the way that they've interacted in CAN, not just this year, but over previous years? Um, about three years ago, I came to CAN with the specific objective to study digital, mobile, and as much uh, uh, technology as I could. And I walked away from that realizing that actually the holy grail of marketing today is when you can develop ideas that uh, you can't actually separate the technology from the idea itself. And uh, that's one of the um, things that we've been driving at Coca-Cola, which has led to things like Small World Machine, which can only happen because of uh, technology, but actually the consumer experience is just about social connection. Okay, briefly, Small World Machine, for people not familiar with it. Small World Machine is, uh, so far this year, it's our most awarded um, uh, initiative. Uh, and it's basically a vending machine technology that can connect people in um, uh, uh, different places. And so we've used it this year to uh, connect people in India and Pakistan, the cultural significance of which is uh, their two nations that have been at war for over 50 years. And you, people can do things like they put their hand on the screen and they yeah, yeah, it's, it's, at the same time interact with each other across the border. That's absolutely right. Uh, what we did is we created two full body windows into each other's world uh, and then we encourage them to make peace, peace signs, make heart signs, make happy faces, uh, make love signs and that's all we thought that we uh, they would do. But as they got comfortable with the technology they started to dance with each other even though they're in different countries and really really kind of like um, have a really unique social experience and that's the value that technology can bring to a brand like Coca-Cola which is all about a social experience in the real world. What you spoke about today, yesterday was not anything to do with technology in a way. It was more about the, the heritage of Coca-Cola in pushing bound different kinds of boundaries. Is that a theme that you've seen spelled out elsewhere in the event? Um, I think that I have the privilege of working on the world's biggest brands and also one of the world's oldest brands. And also a brand that genuinely, genuinely has brought people together over decades, over the last century. And uh, so, um, whilst I do believe that all brands should make a social stand and demonstrate that they're, you know, uh, committed to uh, making the world a better place, I do believe that I have a position of luxury uh, working on Coca-Cola because uh, the brand is so established in the hearts and minds of consumers all over the world for bringing people together for being there at special occasions uh, and uh, uh, for really being a very simple icon of happiness. Great. Okay, I think we have some business to get back to right here on the closet. Thank you very much, Jonathan. This is genuinely the hardest place to do business. <laughs> Thank you very much. Cheers.